Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to use BitCrusher and GarageBand. This is a very simple thing to do so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end, follow my steps correctly so you can make sure that this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do guys is to go ahead and open up the official GarageBand application on your mobile phone if you've not already. If you do not have the application just go to the app store and download it and after opening it up you'll be greeted by this main page right here which is the home page where you can find all the instruments you can access you have your audio recorder as well and so on so let's go ahead and see how we can use bit crusher so the first thing we want to do guys is to open up our mixing mode so we'll do that by opening up any of the instruments right here you can open up whatever you want it's all the same it's going to open up our recording menu where in the upper left corner we'll have these three buttons you want to click the middle button to open up this edit mode and now in this edit mode we can get started taking a look at all the tracks we have such as my drum track right here keyboard audio recording and so on so guys what we want to do is tap on the track we want to add bit crusher for so i'm going to tap on this track right here and after clicking on it we want to click the sliders option right here at the top of the screen and after clicking on your sliders it's going to open up this settings option right here where you can find all the options you can access and once you scroll down you can find your plugins and equalizer so what you want to do is tap on plugins and equalizer and after doing so you want to tap, uh, tap on this edit button so by clicking on edit now as you can see you can add new plugins and equalizers you want to use you want to click on the plus sign and after clicking on plus guys you can see one of the options the first option right here is called the bit crusher so what you want to do is tap on bit crusher guys and now you can go ahead and get started with adding bit crusher effects to your track how much you want so much and so on and that's how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel so you guys thank you for watching take care and bye